Hi, I'm Cale Klein here with Joel Tickner and Ben Johns. Uh, thank you for being with us today, Ben. Where are your home courts and who do you play with? Uh, well, I don't really have uh, home courts really just because I'm either on the road or uh, I'm at school. But uh, if there were some home courts, it would probably be the, the closest park to my house in Maryland uh, where I just play with my brother, which is in Rockville. Yeah, how did you get introduced to the sport of pickleball? Uh, so I did not get introduced by anybody actually, which is kind of a surprising story because most people get introduced by somebody. Uh, I just saw it played one time and it looked like fun. So I was like, hey mom, let's get some paddles and some balls and try this game out. And uh, I did and then I just kind of kept playing it from there. Yeah. Well, we're glad you did. Uh, who is a hero of yours outside of pickleball? Uh, I've actually answered this one in a couple different uh, interviews and I always say the same guy and that's uh, Elon Musk. Yes, for sure. Does anyone else in your family, other than Colin, of course, play pickleball? Uh, so everyone plays pickleball casually for fun, but nobody really plays tournaments. Uh, my older sister has played a couple tournaments. My younger sister's played one, but they all just basically play for fun. What is something you enjoy doing besides pickleball? Uh, let's see, I like reading, weightlifting, hiking, uh, pretty much any sport. I love spike ball, I'll play volleyball. So yeah, it's usually a physical activity or reading. Yes. So what is your go-to food on tournament day? Uh, so I always do eggs for breakfast and then during the tournament day, I'll just do bananas and protein bars because everything else is just too heavy. All right, this one's a little controversial. What is your opinion on the spin serve? Uh, you know, I think pickleball is just like an interesting game in that it gets new developments in the sport and uh, some are for the better of the sport and some aren't. Uh, personally, I came from table tennis, which used to have rules where you could kind of do the similar thing and it had to be banned because it was too good. And I think the general idea is that it's okay to have a powerful serve in this game. I like that. What you don't want is people having to guess, which the game will eventually get there to where you can hide it in such a way that you, you kind of have to guess which way it's going, which is what, ha what happened in table tennis. So I'm not a fan of that. If there's a way to keep the spin serve but not put guessing into it, I'm okay with that. But I don't think you should be able to hide the ball. Yeah, that's a great way of putting it. If you had to pick one, what would be your favorite pickleball memory or victory? Um, I guess my favorite would have to be the first time I won the U.S. Open. Uh, it was 2017 singles just because it was completely unexpected. So I was, uh, I was very happy about that. And then in the future, you know, there were a lot of big wins, but I was somewhat of a, of a favorite or at least in contention, whereas that one was out of the blue completely. Well, awesome. Thank you for your time today, Ben.